Leopold Ruzicka was a Croatian, Swiss, chemist and winner of the 1939 Nobel Prize in Chemistry. He changed his original idea of becoming a priest and switched to studying technical disciplines. Ruzicka's first works originated during the period in the field of chemistry of natural compounds. He remained in this field of research all his life. He investigated the ingredients of the Dalmatian insect powder predrum, a highly esteemed insecticide. In this way, Leopold came into contact with the chemistry of turpin, a fragrant oil of vegetable origin, interesting to the perfume industry. Ruzicka intended to start individual research and even started successful and productive cooperation with the Shoot and Neef Company in Geneva. In 1916, he received the support of the oldest perfume manufacturer in the world, Harman and Reimer. With expertise in the Turpin field, in 1923, Leopold became honorary professor at the Swiss Federal Institute of Technology in Zurich. Ruzicka achieved financial independence, but not as big as he had planned, so he left Zurich to start working for the Sibba, a Basel-based company. In 1927, he shortly left Sibber to take over the organic chemistry chair at Utrecht University in Netherlands. Back in Zurich, Leopold Ruzicka started the most brilliant period of his professional career. After the successful synthesis of sex hormones, his laboratory became the world center of organic chemistry. He published his hypothesis, the biogenetic isoprene rule which was the peak of his scientific career. He received eight honoris causa doctorates in science, medicine, and law, seven prizes and medals and 24 honorary memberships in chemical, biochemical, and other scientific societies. Leopold Ruzicka became an honorary academician at the then Yugoslav Academy of Sciences and Arts. In Switzerland, the Ruzicka Award was established for young chemists working in Switzerland. In his native Vukovar, a museum was opened in his honor, in 1977. Mario Puratic is a Croatian-born American inventor who made major advances in fishing technology, such as the Puratic power block. In 1938 he emigrated to the United States where he worked in Brooklyn's harbor. Later in the harbor of San Pedro. There he worked on tuna fisher boats and trawlers. A good catch of fish meant that many men were necessary to pull the net on board. Within a few months, during 1953 in San Pedro he invented the pyretic power block. A job which once needed around 10 people could now equally quickly be done with only 5 people. It has a form of evening pulley with aluminium skeleton and a central rotating element, often wrapped in hard rubber. Quality of the product was very quickly recognized and up until 1960, most fishing boats in the Northern Seine fleet had installed the power block. In 1972 Canada issued a $5 bill with Puretic power block on the reverse. In 1975, Mario Puratic was proclaimed the inventor of the year in the United States and also one among America's most famous 100 inventors of the 20th century. Matej Rimac is a Croatian inventor entrepreneur and founder of the car company Rimac Automobiles in 2009. Rimac's first invention was a high school project, the iGlove, an electronic glove that replaces the keyboard and the mouse on computers. At the age of 18, Rimac bought a 1984 BMW E30, 323i car and raced it. After the gasoline engine exploded during one race, he decided to turn the car into an electric one. He worked on the car in the garage of his parents and bought pieces for it on the internet. This was the groundwork for his company. The Rimac Concept 1 electric car, the first one designed and manufactured by Rimac Automobiles, was introduced at the Frankfurt Motor Show in 2011. 
The car included company's 24 patented innovations. It was described as the world's first electric supercar. At the 2017 Geneva Motor Show, the company introduced Concept S, an upgraded version, and announced the establishment of official dealerships of its brand in Europe, North America and the Middle East. While manufacturing and marketing high-performance vehicles under its own brand, Rimac also develops and produces battery packs, drivetrain systems and full vehicles for other companies. During the 88th Geneva International Motor Show in March 2018, the company unveiled its second and latest model. The Rimac concept tours the car with the highest power in the world which is 1408 kilowatts. In 2013, Rimac founded a new company, Greit Bikes, a sister company of Rimac Automobiles with the purpose of manufacturing high-performance electric bicycles. In 2014 he received the order of the Croatian Daystar, the 13th most important medal given by the Republic of Croatia. Forbes magazine named Rimac one of the top 30 under 30, in 2017. Nikola Tesla was a Serbo-Croatian and American inventor, electrical engineer, mechanical engineer and futurist who is best known for his contributions to the design of the modern alternating current. Born and raised in the Austrian Empire, Tesla received an advanced education in engineering and physics in the 1870s. He gained practical experience in the early 1880s working in telephony and at Continental Edison in the new electric power industry. He emigrated to the United States in 1884, where he would become a naturalized citizen. Nikola worked for a short time at the Edison Machine Works in New York City before he struck out on his own. With the help of partners to finance and market his ideas, Tesla set up laboratories and companies in New York to develop a range of electrical and mechanical devices. His alternating current induction motor and related polyphased patents, licensed by Westinghouse Electric in 1888, earned him a considerable amount of money. Attempting to develop inventions he could patent and market, Tesla conducted a range of experiments with mechanical oscillators, generators, electrical discharge tubes, and early X-ray imaging. He also built a wireless-controlled boat. One of the first ever exhibited. Nikola Tesla became well known as an inventor and would demonstrate his achievements to celebrities and wealthy patrons at his lab. He was also noted for his showmanship at public lectures. Throughout the 1890s, Tesla pursued his ideas for worldwide wireless electric power distribution in his high-voltage, high-frequency power experiments in New York and Colorado Springs. In 1893, he tried to put these ideas to practical use in Warden Cliff Tower project, but ran out of funding before he could complete it. After Warden Cliff, Nikola Tesla experimented with a series of inventions in the 1910s and 1920s with varying degrees of success. Having spent most of his money, Tesla lived in a series of New York hotels, leaving behind unpaid bills. He died in New York City in January 1943. His work fell into relative obscurity following his death. In 1960, the General Conference on Weights and Measures named the SI unit of magnetic flux density, the Tesla, in his honor. Numerous statues were raised in his name and a Nikola Tesla Museum was opened in Belgrade. There have been subsequent claims by biographers that Edison and Tesla were both the original recipients of the 1915 Nobel Prize in Physics and that both refused to share it. 
SMSP by phone parking was invented by young Croatian innovators and introduced by Vipnit. Since its introduction in Croatian capital of Zagreb in 2001, the number of registered users has been steadily increasing and by 2004, it was the largest in Europe. From then on pay by phone parking was introduced to other countries and is currently used by millions of people all around the world. The word quarantine originates from the Venetian dialect form of the Italian quarantagione, meaning 40 days. This is due to the 40-day isolation of ships and people before entering the city-state of Ragusa, which is modern Dubrovnik. This was practiced as a measure of disease prevention related to the Black Death. The original document from 1377, which is kept in the archives of Dubrovnik, states that before entering the city, newcomers had to spend 30 days in a restricted place waiting to see whether the symptoms of Black Death would develop. Roger Joseph Boscovich was a physicist, astronomer, mathematician, philosopher, diplomat, poet, theologian, Jesuit priest and a polymath from the city-state of Ragusa. He produced a precursor of atomic theory. Made many contributions to astronomy, including the first geometric procedure for determining the equator of a rotating planet from three observations of a surface feature for computing the orbit of a planet from three observations of its position. In 1753 he also discovered the absence of atmosphere on the moon. In 1745 Boscovich published De Viribus Vivis, in which he tried to find a middle way between Isaac Newton's gravitational theory and Gottfried Leibniz's metaphysical theory. He developed a concept of impenetrability as a property of hard bodies which explained their behavior in terms of force rather than matter. Stripping atoms of their matter, impenetrability is disassociated from hardness and then put in an arbitrary relationship to elasticity. In Vienna, in 1758, he published the first edition of his famous work, Philosophy Naturalized Theory. The book contained his atomic theory and his theory of forces. The largest Croatian Institute of Natural Sciences and Technology, based in Zagreb, is called Roger Joseph Boscovich. In 1782, he was one of the founders of the Italian National Association of the Sciences. This society gathered 40 members representing the most important Italian scientists of the period. The oldest astronomical society in the Balkans based in Serbia's capital Belgrade is called Astronomical Society, Roger Boscovich. Boscovich was a member of the British Royal Society and Russian Academy of Sciences. In 1873, Nietzsche wrote a fragment called Time Atom Theory, which was a reworking of Roger's theory of philosophy naturalize. In general, Boscovich's ideas were a large influence on Nietzsche's ideas of force and the will to power. Slava Ljubedvard Pankala was a Croatian engineer and inventor. He became renowned for further development of the mechanical pencil, then called an automatic pencil, and for development of the first solid ink found in pen. Collaborating with an entrepreneur by the name of Edmund Moster, he started the Pencala Moster Company and built a pen and pencil factory that was one of the biggest in the world at the time. The company, now called TOZ Pencala, still exists today. Pencala also constructed the first Croatian aircraft, the Pencala 1910 biplane, flown by Dragutin Novak, who was also the first Croatian pilot. He constructed and invented many other products and devices, and held a total of 80 patents. Stjepan Maharovercic was a Croatian physicist, geophysicist and meteorologist. He began his career in seismology with his father, Andrija Maharovercic. 
In 1913 he developed a new method for locating the hypercenter of an earthquake and gave an independent verification of discontinuity theory put forward by his father. In 1916 Stiepen published an idea of the existence of smaller discontinuities in Earth's crust and mantle. Stiepen Maharavirchich put forward his own theory about the composition and the formation of the Moon, explosive formation of lunar craters and predicted the existence of Moholaya on the Moon. The existence of Moholaya on the Moon was confirmed in 1969 by seismic measurements done by Apollo 11 crew. But Maharavirchich's biggest contribution is the prediction of the existence of positronium, it was experimentally discovered in 1951 by Martin Deutsch. Thomas Levdo Mazet Losho is a Croatian geneticist. In 2007, he discovered a method of genomic philostratigraphy which states that every living organism in its genome carries a record of its evolutionary path. Hence, it is possible to read the evolutionary history of a species. Before this discovery, the only direct approach to the research of evolutionary history of a species was to study and compare the fossil remains. Since it is impossible to predict where certain fossils are to be found, evolutionary research is largely dependent on good fortune in the discovery of high-quality paleontological finds. They have also discovered that approximately in the middle of embryonic development there is a period when all vertebrae are morphologically similar. At this stage, which is called file types, differences in the appearance of fish, reptiles, and mammals are almost insignificant. Vladimir Prelog was a Croatian-Swiss organic chemist who received the 1975 Nobel Prize in Chemistry for his research into the stereochemistry of organic molecules and reactions. In 1922, as a 16-year-old boy, his first scientific work was published in the German scientific journal. The article concerned an analytical instrument used in chemical labs. Prolog wanted to work in an academic environment, so he accepted the position of lecturer at the University of Zagreb in 1935. With the help of collaborators and students, Vladimir started researching quinine and its related compounds. He developed a financially successful method of producing streptazole, one of the first commercial sulfonamides. In 1941, while at Zagreb, Prolog developed the first synthesis of adamantin, a hydrocarbon with an unusual structure that was isolated from Moravian oil fields. Specifying the growing number of stereoisomers of organic compounds became one of his important aims. In 1954 he joined Dar Eskan and Christopher Ingold in their efforts to build such system that could be easily assigned and deciphered. The CIP system was developed. Vladimir Prolog was elected a foreign member of the Royal Society in 1962 for his contribution to the development of modern stereochemistry. Vladimir received the 1975 Nobel Prize in Chemistry, sharing it with the Australian-British research chemist John Cornforth. In 1986, he became an honorary member of the Yugoslav Academy of Sciences and Arts.